fundamental move, number 13, is another prone one on our tummy, and we're going to do a little prone chest lifting now, or thoracic extension. So thoracic just means that it refers to the portion of the spine that runs through the rib cage. That's your thoracic cavity, that's your thoracic spine. So it's just how to lift your head and chest and shoulders when you're lying on your tummy. So it starts with that little prone cervical lift, so she's going to keep her neck nice and long as it starts to lift up. And then the collarbones are going to open a little bit, and then instead of thinking up, think forwards with your breastbone, forward, so that we're bending in between these vertebrae here, but not too much of her back yet, and then slowly down, or her lower back, I meant to say, right? Genevieve is a dancer and she's very flexible, so I bet if I asked her to, let's do a bad one, I want you to use your lower back. To, she's going to bend through her lower back to come up. Oh yeah, yep, see, right there, and down, <laughs> right? So when, even when you're just doing that thoracic extension, you're going to feel these muscles work. That's okay. It's what we're trying to do right now is not move through these vertebrae yet. We're trying to move through the, the thoracic spine or the upper back. So we'll do two more like that. So as you breathe in, the neck gets longer. You're gonna come up, the collarbones open a little. And it's like you're bending around your own bra strap. Collar, the chest is going forwards. Good, see she didn't really change her lower back. And then exhale, lower down. Good. And let the shoulders relax for a moment. Good, good. And we'll do just one more. So as you breathe in, the neck gets longer. The collarbones are going to open. Think breastbone forwards more than breastbone up. And that'll keep length in your back, even as you're working right in between your shoulder blades. Very nice. And slowly down. And you might have noticed as you were doing those, if you kept the tummy a little bit pulled in, you get a little abdominal stretch, which is nice. Okay, so that is, uh, sometimes we call that a mini swan, because it's a smaller part of this big Pilates move called the swan or the swan dive, or thoracic extension.